Okay, so today we are going to be showcasing the new Entrusted Will category team on Global led by the AGL Transforming Super Saiyan Trunks, who I was able to pull two copies of in my summoning video yesterday. And the event is Extreme Super Battle Road, which is still, in my opinion, one of the hardest events in the entire game. And on this team, we have the double AGL Trunkses. They're both at 79, no, sorry, uh, 69%. And we also have SDR Super Saiyan Trunks, AGL UI Goku, Tech Gohan, uh, Int UI Goku, and the Fizz LR Bardock, who honestly is mainly here because I needed a Fizz unit to fulfill the type requirement on the Super Class stage, but obviously he is still very, very good. So that is our Entrusted Will team. And for this first rotation, we have the two Trunkses as well as UI Goku. And the AGL Trunks is starting with 125k defense, which is not bad, but it could be a lot better. He is definitely a slot 2 unit because after he supers, he should be looking at close to like 300k defense, I believe. So we'll put the STR Trunks in the first slot. I'm going to pop an Icarus. And let's see how this goes. So since we don't have type advantage here, let's go for... This guy, which is Shisami, I think. I've called him Sashimi many, many times. People have corrected me many, many times. I believe I got it right this time. Shisami, right? Doesn't matter. Okay. So, uh, some pretty good tanking there from the STR trunks. Good start. No supers yet. Oh, there's a super. Okay. Um, 88k. That's okay. That's okay. All right, so my trunk starting with 3.6 mil for the first attack. A couple of additionals, most likely. Okay, and probably a fourth one. And there's the additional super. So this guy actually has a pretty interesting passive. Um, the way he works is, of course, you get the initial attack, right? And then after you get two more attacks, uh, I think it's a high chance for those two additional attacks. And then if those two additional attacks proc, then you get a fourth attack who has, or which has a high chance to become a super. I'm not sure if I got the chances right. It's either high chance or great chance. I gotta check on that, but yeah, like I said, very, very interesting passive, a uh, pretty unique passive. Goku, come on, man. Like, this always happens. This always happens. This man loves to dodge normals. 70% chance to dodge, right? Great chance to dodge. And just eats supers all the time. It makes no sense. It makes absolutely no sense. I don't get it, but okay. Um, it is what it is. That's just UI Goku for you. So let me just quickly check the passive though, because I want to make sure I got all of the like great chances and high chances, stuff like that. So it is, okay, great chance of launching up to two additional attacks and then launches another additional attack that has a great chance of becoming a super attack every time the character attacks three times in battle up to once within the turn. So yeah, basically you have a great chance for two additional attacks and if those additional attacks proc, then you get that fourth attack, which has a great chance to become super. So as I said, just a very interesting passive and um, they're actually getting that additional super, I would say pretty regularly, um, at least like every other turn in my experience. So anyways, um, on this turn, um, I'm going to keep the UI for sure because I want to get that double UI rotation, although the links are really bad, like really, really bad here. Um, let's see, so I'll give one int orb so I can get the super for my Gohan, okay. And then Trunks looks like is not gonna be getting a super, which um, is unfortunate, but I guess we'll just keep attacking Frieza. You know what, maybe I should have saved the Frieza for later, because we have LR Bardock, who gets a huge boost. Like a huge, huge boost when um, he's fighting Frieza. So I'm kind of hoping we don't kill Frieza this turn. But I also noticed that we're kind of low on HP. So I'm a little bit worried. I mean, I'm not worried about the Gohan. I'm more so worried about the Trunks. If Trunks gets supered, 
by Tagoma. Um, we might be done. We might be done. So hopefully that doesn't happen. Please don't super me, man. Don't do it. Oh, thank you. Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay. Um, I'm going to pop a. What should we? Oh, we killed Frieza. Damn it. Okay. So no boost for Bardock, but some good defense all around, nonetheless. Let me use a Android 8. We heal up, get some more defense. Um, yeah, almost 200k for the AGL trunks, 250 and 270 respectively for the Bardock and the STR trunks. And uh, let's just go for, let's go for Sorbet this turn. All right, there we go. And not quite, oh, actually, never mind. 18k super for the LR Bardock, perfect. That worked out really well. Ooh, nice additional super. Oh my god. Oh, it's not bad. It's not bad. Um, nice additional super for the uh, STR trunks with the stun as well. I like to see that. And here is trunks with two more additional attacks. There's the fourth and another super. Like I said, it happens like almost every other turn. Uh, we got lucky this time and got it back to back turns. And then another attack. So I guess in theory, you could get actually three supers with him. Um, you don't see that as often, but it is definitely possible to get your first super and then two more attacks and then another super and then another super. Okay. Um, I guess we might as well use the UI Goku active skill because why not? But I'm really hoping at some point in this showcase or in this run we get to see Super Saiyan Drunks because that guy hits a lot harder and the reason I decided to do Super Battle Road over you know, the Legendary Goku event or Legendary Vegeta event is that uh, we're able to actually seal and stun enemies, right? And you need to be able to seal and stun to get the most out of your Super Saiyan Trunks. He gets a huge attack boost for being able to seal and stun enemies. So, oh, here we go. Okay, so this looks like a good chance to get that going here. We need to launch six attacks. Six attacks with Trunks, which is basically two appearances if he's getting three to four attacks every single turn. So first things first, let's pop the Whis. Okay, and I think we should be fine um, since there's only one attack in the first slot before we get to attack. So I'm gonna put Trunks there, or they're all Trunks actually, the AGL Trunks. Um, let me just see about which one though to put. I think, yeah, the friend one's better, even though they're both 69% is I believe has better links yes it's better than mine so all right we'll put him there and uh, we'll go for Vegeta all right we need the poo is next and then back to Vegeta all right so 3.68 for the friend which I think is a little bit higher than what mine was. I didn't pay attention to his um, skill orbs though, so I'm not sure if he has better skill orbs than mine. And another additional super. So, yo, maybe more than every other turn. I guess it's like two out of three turns, you're probably looking at double supers, and then maybe like every third turn or every fourth turn, you get the triple super if you have some hidden potential investment. I do believe additionals are the best way to go for the Trunks because, um, you know, when you become Super Saiyan Trunks, when you get that transformation going, which, you know, sometimes you can't, but when you do, then he's getting a great chance to crit with every attack, right? So with such a high crit chance, it doesn't really make sense to have, um, you know, a lot of addition, or rather a lot of crit in your hidden potential, so additionals would definitely be the way to go. In my opinion, once again. Okay, uh, we got the double UIs finally. That took a while. And we have any... We, we have Whis active still, I believe, right? So, yeah, even if Goku decides to eat another super, which is definitely possible, 
I think it's gonna be okay. And I'm gonna go for, let's go for Winnie the Pooh here. I actually don't wanna go for like 18k supers because well, I guess we might as well since we're doing a showcase. But <laughs> I was gonna say, I'd rather just keep these guys alive for as long as possible so that I can get my Super Saiyan Trunks transformation. Um, it's gonna be tough, man. It, it's definitely hard to get him to launch six attacks and then also come back for another appearance to get the Super Saiyan transformation active skill off. Um, I think this team is just a little bit too OP. It's a, it's a little bit too powerful. So maybe I should have brought a slightly weaker team, but since we're doing a team showcase, um, I always like to, you know, bring as powerful of a team as I possibly can, right? So it's it, it's tough, man. It, it's it's a it's a conundrum. It's a dilemma. But, but anyways, um, <laughs> we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. So uh, oh no 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 no, I did not mean to do that. Ah oh, crap. See, I was trying to item, I was trying to click item, and why did the music stop? One sec. Uh, let's play... Namek Goku. I think that's fine. Anyways, um, I was trying to click item, and instead I hit the auto battle by accident, so now it's making me put the Super Saiyan Trunks in front of the Kappa attack, which is terrifying, because if Kappa supers us, that might be GG for us, so I'm gonna pop a Princess Snake for sure. Um, I almost want to pop like a second item, but I'm gonna save it because I'm praying that it's not a super attack before we get to super. And uh, all right, let's just give a few orbs here. Okay, here we go. Thank God that was not a super because it would have been really, really bad, man. That would have hurt a lot. Like, we probably would have taken, I don't know, 300k plus, most likely. And now we definitely satisfied the, uh, what do you call it, the, the six attacks requirement, because in total we've actually launched eight attacks at this point. Make that nine attacks. <laughs> so there's the triple super turn I was looking for. <clears throat> but it's going to be tough to... Uh, Keep these guys alive for one more appearance. Is it going to be possible to maybe not launch any supers next turn? I don't think so, because UI Goku, like AGL UI, seems to always launch at least one additional super, even if we don't give him, give him enough orbs to launch a normal super. And when he's linked with the int UI, I don't think it's even possible to not launch a super attack anyways. I don't know, man, it's going to be tough. Is gonna be tough, but I'm gonna try make it work. Um, nope, nope, he's definitely dead. Frost is 1,000% dead, man. There's no way I can keep him alive. Like I can give one orb to the trunks, but the double UIs, <sighs> yeah, it's not gonna work, man. It's not gonna work. This guy's gonna launch at least two supers, and then NTY is gonna hit for at least like a couple mil. So, yeah, Frost is dead, unfortunately. I wish Frost could dodge. That would actually be great if Frost could actually dodge. Um, so I guess like this is not the best event to really showcase the trunk since we can't even get his Super Saiyan transformation off. Okay, we got one more chance though. We got one more chance to make it happen. These guys, I remember, have a lot of HP. So, um, it could definitely work. It could definitely work. I'm gonna pop a Whis first. And I'm gonna go for actually not type of bandage. So, obviously, I could have attacked the Rose, but instead, we're gonna attack the Zamasu with our SDR trunks. And I'm going to, I mean, we gotta get a super off either way, so it doesn't really matter there. And. Let's go for Rose instead. I'm, a, I'm only going to give him one orb. So no 18k super. I think we could have gotten 18k, but no 18k super for the for the Bardock. We're just going to try to do as little damage as possible. <sighs> Why additional? Why additional? We're going to try to do as little damage as possible. 
for the next few turns, just so we can hopefully get the Super Saiyan Trunks appearance. At least one time. At least once. Oh man, okay. Double Super again. You know what, at this point he's probably gonna triple Super. Probably gonna triple, oh yeah. I mean, this is great too. This is impressive. This is impressive. But I wanna see Super Saiyan Trunks, man. <laughs> I really want to see Super Saiyan Trunks, and 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 this team is just is too good. It's too good. Ooh, this might be bad. This this uh, what? You know what? Better than I expected. Um, I'm gonna break up the UIs. I'm gonna break up the UIs. Okay, I think this is the only way. This is the only way. So. <laughs> Here we go. It's one orb for int UI. Um, he might be in some trouble actually at the end there. I just realized that we have three phase attacks. And of course this man gets an additional super. What else is new? Even if we actually manage to keep Rose alive for this rotation. I mean he's definitely going to stay alive. That's, that's a guarantee but... The concern would be next rotation, Trunks is gonna go off again, right? Trunks is gonna get probably like two more supers at least. And we're probably still gonna kill Rose either way, aren't we? I think so. I think so. Okay, um. Alright, well, let's see what happens. Here we go. Okay, only one orb. For the uh, trunks, one orb for my trunks. Oh my god, dude. Can I just screw up this token attack? Can I just. I'm not gonna. Does that affect the damage? Maybe. Or does it only affect the healing? I actually don't know what getting like a good token attack, you know, um. Like getting like uh, all the nodes or whatever, like how that affects your token attack result, right? Like, is it is it damage or does it affect the healing more or something else? Yo, guys, I think we're actually gonna do it. I think we're actually gonna do it. At least we have a good chance here. Next turn, once again, not gonna give anybody supers. Hopefully, UI does not decide to go off, and. Uh, we, we should have a really good turn here. With the, or rather, at least just like get the Trunks transformation, you know? No! No, come on, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit, please. Another additional, oh my god, why? Yeah, this shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, I do 3k, fine. Um... Okay, so it seems like there's no way to not let Bardock super. And I think that's it, guys. I think that's the end of our attempt to get... Oh, you know what? I forgot to item. Well, either way, it doesn't matter. He's dead. Um, yeah, man, that's, that's going to do it. That's going to do it. Do <laughs> we ended off on a tech Gohan <laughs> uh, normal attack? Talk about anticlimactic. I was hoping we would actually end on a you know Super Saiyan Trunks um, super with like over five six mil attack stat, guaranteed crit, all that good stuff. But yeah, man, this team's just too good. This this team is just too powerful to the point where. I can't even get a Trunk Super Saiyan transformation when I'm purposely trying to not get supers, you know? Like, everyone's just getting all these additional supers. Trunks is going off with his million, um, you know, supers, right? Like, getting two to three supers literally every single turn. I don't know if there was a turn where we didn't get two supers, actually. I'm pretty sure we got double supers every single turn that there was 
and AGL trunks. So it's very common. It's very common in case you guys were wondering if that was like, you know, a rare occurrence. Nah, man, happens all the time. The double supers happen all the time, sometimes even a triple super. Um, the guy's just a beast and you didn't even get to see him at his full potential. That's the crazy part. You did not get to see him at his full powers. Um, so I guess I'll have to come back and do a different showcase, maybe on, um, I don't know, the God event might, might be good, but I don't think those guys can be sealed or stunned either, so what would be a good, I guess I just need like a harder, harder Super Battle Road stage. They need to release like extreme, extreme Super Battle Road, or like, I don't know, like what what's over, what's above extreme. Um, Ultra, I don't know. <laughs> the point is, Extreme Super Batter is too easy now, apparently. So, <laughs> there you have it, guys. That is the um, team showcase for. What's it called again? Entrusted Will. My bad. Entrusted Will. And uh, even though we didn't get the Trunks transformation, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video nonetheless. Um, as always, if you guys liked, the video then make sure to like the damn video sub to the channel if you're new hit that notification bell so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and uh until next time have an awesome awesome day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out <laughs>